So if your check engine light has turned on and you don't have any special tools and you just wanna turn it off and not know what the code is or what the problem is, here's how you can do that. Um, ideally, you'd wanna get a code reader like that, the link in description below, and use it to read the code. And then you could also use that to turn off the light if you just wanna turn off the light. But if you don't have a code reader, here's what you do. Open the hood. And then disconnect the battery from the car. So you're gonna to wanna to remove the ground cable. Remove it and leave it off of the battery for 15 minutes and then put it back on and doing that will reset the computer and then you won't have the check engine light anymore. It will also, you'll lose your radio stations and your clock will have to be reset. So it's gonna reset a bunch of other stuff in your car, anything that doesn't have its own little battery in it, but that will clear your codes. And then they will come back if there's actually something wrong with your car, but sometimes it'll just glitch and then the check engine light won't come back on because it's just a one-time thing. Like if you have to pass emissions right away and you think it was just a one-time thing, you do this. And then if the check engine light comes back on, then you gotta ch check it and fix it and figure out what it actually is. All right, here we go. Come on, big bucks, no whammies. Woo, light's gone. Used to be there, now it ain't. So that'll do.